Hi everybody, it's 11 o'clock in the morning and this is Nava with Prayer at 11. And today I would like to pray for balance and ease and flow in my, uh, in our time, our lives, our work schedules, and so on. So here we go. Settle in. I am just remembering in this moment that there really is only one thing happening despite anything that seems to be going on in my life, any facts, any occurrences. Really underneath it all, there is one thing happening and it is this thing we call life. It is this presence in which all of that activity occurs. It is that stillness that is eternal, that is infinite, that is always here, was here long before humans and will remain long after humans. It is this presence, this force that we call life or spirit or God, goddess, Whatever name we give it, it is the same thing. And so I remember the stars at night, even when they are not visible because of rain or nighttime or clouds or hail that we've had lately. It is still, the stars are still there, held in that vast space, which always, always reminds me of the magnitude of what is real, what is ever-present, what is beyond anything that might be happening. This one presence in which all life appears. And I am so, so grateful to recognize and remember this. And since that's all there is, that must be what I am made of. That must be what each person listening is made of. And it must be what is speaking this prayer now. So each person hearing this prayer is made of this presence, is a collection of light this infinite presence expressing as them. It is expressing as each person here. And that is the presence and the stillness and the peace that is always available to tap into and remember. Each breath is a new way to be filled again and remember. And each exhale is a way to let go of whatever is weighing on our minds. And so I know that if, since this one presence can hold all our planets in orbit and can hold the entire universe in balance and flow and ease and perfection, I know that it could easily easily handle whatever's going on in my life. And so I just invite and welcome in our lives an expression, an experience of this flow happening that as we live from center, as we move and touch in to center, everything becomes easier. Our inner guidance system, which is that one presence, informs us of what is the most appropriate thing to do right now. And in focusing on that one thing, it is easily handled and done. And that all the things on the to-do list happen in their time, happen easily, beautifully, wonderfully, with ample time 
ample flow. It just goes easily because guess what? Spirit is doing it through us. We don't have to do it all ourselves. And Spirit may even guide us to realize some resources and help that are available for us. Spirit might guide us when we tap in and inform us of an easier way or a, what's the priority right now or resources we did not realize we had available to us. How delightful, how wonderful to know that Spirit is doing it through us and is walking with us, moving with us, as us, in us. And it is all happening through us. It does not need to be all on our own mind and shoulders. It's all handled. It's all working out fine. And in knowing that this is already done in the mind of God, there's really nothing left I need to do but release my word to that law that has already said a resounding yes. And I just let it unfold as my life and let it be. And so it is. Talk to you tomorrow. Have a blessed day.